Good morning and thank you for joining us. Let's start today's technical analysis with the dollar yen pair and the recent events stirring the markets. Greg? The oil dollar pair saw a minor dip of 0.2% in the last session. The Williams indicator is giving a negative signal. The pound dollar pair traded sideways in the last session. The ultimate oscillator indicates an overbought market. The Bitcoin dollar pair exploded 4.3% in the last session. The Williams indicator indicates an overbought market. The gold dollar pair gained 0.2% in the last session, after rising as much as 1.2% during the session. The stochastic indicator indicates an overbought market. Moving on to world financial news. Bitcoin last closed above $68,000 on April the 11th. Despite trading above $60,000 several times in the past five days, even as Bitcoin gained 2% yesterday, another 7% move is needed to meet its all-time high. BTC gained 51% total this year. Saudi Arabia's crude oil exports rose for the second straight month in March, reaching their highest in nine months. Data from the Joint Organization's Data Initiative showed. Saudi Arabia is the world's largest exporter of crude oil. The Nasdaq touched a record high, while the S&P 500 gained slightly as technology stocks advanced ahead of Nvidia's highly anticipated earnings, and investors gauged the timing of an interest rate cut by the Federal Reserve. Thank you for your insightful ideas. And now, let's review today's major economic events. Germany's producer price index will be released at 6 GMT. The U.S. Red Book Index at 12.55 GMT. The U.S. API Weekly Crude Oil Stock at 20.30 GMT. Japan's imports will be released at 23.50 GMT. The Eurozone's Eurogroup Meeting at 7 GMT. Australia's RBA Meeting Minutes at 1.30 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed today's market outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day.